Welcome back to Destination Playdate. I am your host, Attack Slug, and this is Shift 2 out today on catalog for a price of $6. As always, full disclosure, they sent me a copy. It's been about a year and a half since Shift 1. Let's get back to puzzling in three distinct modes. We have the calm, we have the frantic, and we have the tactical. Thinking, thinking, thinking. And so let's begin with the calm, which is the most similar to the original shift. This time, there are no empty spaces to push and pull things into, and as far as I can tell, there's no crank functionality in this one, which is fine. Like, you don't always need to have it even though it's there on the playdate. So, much like the first one, we're wrapping around here trying to match four tiles. And so, we hold the A button, we grab the tile, and then we move it to the left and matches those four. Now, obviously, there's a lot more than just the black and white tiles this time. Bottom right-hand corner is your energy, and when that goes to zero, it's game over. So, high score business. Now, what is majorly different here, besides having multiple different types of tiles, is being able to either upgrade or downgrade the tiles. And that is significant because your high score is also based on your streak, which is your multiplier, and if you upgrade or downgrade, that does not break your streak, unlike when you don't match some tiles. So right here, you're saying, oh man, I can't match four without upgrading or downgrading, and so I'll go down here to this white tile, I'm gonna hit A, black tile, streak two. We're good. So the thing is, uh, that also costs you energy. So you don't want to just use it all crazy-like because you're going to run out of energy and die quite quickly. But also here is, I will do just, you know, this one over here, which means, all right, back to one on no streak, but less energy consumed on that. So I'm going to do that there. I could have done upgrade, then upgrade, but let's not do that right now. So additionally, this tile here is one of two types of wild card. And you'll know which is which by which is the shape of the hourglass. This one is the white one, other way would be the black one. But I will now, on this black tile, hit the A button for the upgrade. Just one upgrade, okay, we're good. If it has to go multiple up or down, then it ends up being an issue. So we wrap around here with this black tile, match four. We, yeah, I can also, again, keep using this to do that, which is fine. It kind of evens out mostly. You just don't want to just be using it too much because you're going to end up getting into a bad spot uh, with yourself, which is no good. Now, my main thing that has been my downfall thus far is not keeping in mind which direction the upgrades and the downgrades go in. Because it is a certain level of direction, and if you get confused and go the wrong way, you're just totally screwed. Absolutely boned on that. But so far, we are, you know, pretty early here and doing okay. I can do that there to get that done. And it will cascade occasionally to get you higher streaks, higher scores, and that. But certainly you want to focus on that streak because it's kind of important in getting your leaderboard high score. Which, yes, there are online leaderboards here. It is catalog after all. And so you see, even having this wild card here, because it is the black one and not the white one, I gotta hit A. There are two different ones for the wild card. Now, if at any time you go, oh man, what are all the symbols? You can kind of hit pause here and then you can see, all right, solid, box in the middle, and circle are your three different symbols on each side and then two different wild cards for each color. So here, I back up and back up and it goes to that. And then we continue with what we are doing here with matching these bits Abiedness, and again, it's all about how long you can make that energy last and get it done that away. So we don't, I mean, we can go up, up. See, that's not what we want to do. Like, that's too much energy for getting one. I mean, yes, you maintain your streak of 10, great, but at the same time, your energy here is just clearly not doing well. So there is that, and that drops the streak. It is what it is, right? At a certain point, you do. What she does, oops, that was, and don't, like, after you shift, get your finger off the button, because you might accidentally do what I just did there and waste energy on things you don't need to do, which, unfortunate, but we're kind of in the, yep, I can't do anything now, so we are at the tail end here of this very short playthrough, and 
uh, I have no other real options here to get to where I need to go because everything is so far away, and then we just say, hey man, game over. Final score plus your best streak of 11, and that is the calm. Now then, the frantic is indeed just that, because now there is a timer. And getting yourself those points and combos and whatnot will add time onto that timer. But otherwise, it is constantly counting down, and it's, hey man, just scramble, because otherwise, it's going to be a bad time. So, that one there. So, I've not done that well. Oh, also, you only have to shift one upgrade, up or down. And then it's, oh man, just find your match, because otherwise, just not. Nah, it's going to be uh, a lot. A lot. So... You know, it's certainly a welcome change from just, you know, I'm going to chill type mode. But uh, as someone who has to sit here and talk and play at the same time, that's where I get caught up in the video games on this channel. Um, that's the wrong way. I can only do one. I went the wrong way and I botched it. And the timer here is just tick, tick, ticking. And it's going to be a big old problem very quickly. So I can get some more matches here uh, and get some more time on the clock, which is not looking good. It's not looking good. Nope, nope, nope. All right. Game over on The Frantic. Not my best, but that is what it is. Now, in the final mode of the three, we have The Tactical. In this mode, you need to make a match every single turn. The only thing that matters is your streak. So, then the energy is very important for doing the upgrades and downgrades, and at that point you have to memorize which which goes which, because it's really going to be a disaster if you get the one wrong, going the wrong way. So right here, we're like, alright, um, what can we do? Because we have to get one moved, and if I back out from, hmm, this one to black and to white, and then bring down the white, then okay, streak three, I'm okay, but you can get yourself real trapped here real easy because that's just the nature of the business of this. Now, I do have this wild card here, so if I upgrade twice, yes, that launches that wild card, and we're good here on streak number four. So, I don't know that I have enough energy to get this one to black. I do, all right, it's just one. Again, I have not quite memorized the order and the direction of the upgrades and downgrades, which are very essential to playing shift two. So if I go back to white here, and then up there, get back some energy on streak six, and it's not looking... I can go one here, and then one here, and we're on seven, but... All right, yes, wild card. Oh, see, again, memorizing which wild card is which is also essential to not do that, which I just did here on the show. So... Those are your three modes in Shift 2, and you have your both local and online leaderboards. But again, this is pre-release being filmed, so then we get the internet involved, and here are the online leaderboards for the calm and the frantic and the tactical. Now, I don't know how often these upload and refresh. Because if you notice there in that first one, it says my score is 784. However, my top score is 2645. So I'm not sure at what point that's going to update. I don't know. In any event, this is Shift 2 out now on catalog or out today at some point whenever that drops on catalog. Uh, six bucks. Link in the description. Check it out. Keep on cranking. More videos right here on this channel. I'll see you next time. And I'm out.